We've just come uh, out of this moment where Serena Williams was reprimanded at the French Open for wearing this bodysuit that, again, mm -hmm. Who objects to this? Yeah. And she had health reasons for wearing it. Right. Apparently, I didn't realize that. You know, her cat suit made all this news. Serena Williams' cat suit at the, at the French Open. It should. By it the way. was a good cat suit. It was <laughs> fabulous. And no one could pull off the cat suit like Serena. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but she had blood clot issues. Right. Right. And was so it compression. Suit? Yes. It's compression to hose, and she had health that. reasons yeah. for wearing it, and she still gets reprimanded for not what dressing like a lady on the tennis court, which is absurd. She's an athlete. Yeah. And meanwhile, she has probably done more for women's tennis than any player right. in history. Right. Yeah. It's true. And so, and you know what? To me, it's like. U.S. tennis, and apparently this is a rule from women's, the Women's Tennis Association, WTA, uh, that, that's getting the French player in trouble. Um, but I guess that's, I, I didn't realize that the women's tennis players are organized under WTA and the men's are under ATP, mm -hmm. whatever it is. Anyway, um, they had a moment to be sort of, to take the high road, to say, oh, the French, the French people, they don't want Serena in her cat suit. Right. But we allow diversity and the As expression. As Americans, for yeah. freedom. We allow the, yes. we love compression garments. <laughs> Sarah Blakely, who invented Spanx, is an American. <laughs>